So when we last left off, we had run into problems. Okay, we 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 met our new team member, uh, Diana, who is terminally ill. Theoretically, she could, if she's willing to go through the treatment, she could get through this. But she has to have. The willingness to take part in the treatment. It's implied, like, it's more of a, oh, her, she doesn't want to get better, so she won't get better, but to a certain degree, like when it comes to medical treatment, the patient has to want to, has to want to get well, if, because they usually requires the patient to take independent steps, um, in any case. So we're trying to restore her desire for life. Here's as we currently stand for relationships among our team members. My door open because we can't with me. Need to work on building a relationship with Jiminy because she's our poll winner on the opportunity boards. Go to forum.rpg.net. You can take part in the poll and determine who we act, who we are focusing our attention on. All right, so. Currently, we are now going to be going and taking Diana out of the town before going to go see a play. Specifically, Hamlet. Which, again, as I mentioned last time, not my first choice of Shakespeare plays. One moment. First choice would be, like, Comedy of Errors... Maybe Twelfth Night. Aha. Uh -huh. You know what? That is actually really good. Like, like there's a natural first opening words here. Also, I will admit, I don't see Hamlet as a musical. I could see somebody doing it as a musical. I'm not sure how you'd work it. If somebody has, by the way, done like a musical version of Hamlet in some manner or another. Um, say for, um, like, either, like, directly or if the re reworking, like how um, West Side Story is a reworking of um, Romeo and Juliet, I would absolutely, 100%, love to know about it. Um, and please post in the comments about that version of the music of the the musical or the, the play as a musical for that matter like any other shakespeare like if there's a shakespeare adaptation into musical form that you like musical theater go ahead and share that in the comments anyway i'd be interested just interested to hear outside outside of west side story um there's probably some others that uh, like i'm gonna go oh yeah right that one but other than that, I, I don't know. So I'd be interested to hear. Huh. Okay. I mean, musicals, like opera, I could see someone going, okay, I, I don't understand the narrative because we're in a, it's in a language I don't, I don't understand. And 
because we're in the 1920s, you don't have the option of on-screen subtitles or that sort of thing. Or on stage, sub uh, either below or above the stage, uh, subtitles for the, for the words. Um, or that sort of, or seat back subtitles or anything like that. Um, so, yeah, that's, like, that one I get, but musicals, it's all in English, and usually they wear the plot on their sleeve pretty clearly. Don't worry, we've decided to make the, um, yep. We're making, we are making the Little Lip Theater, the, the United States' first ADA-equipped, um, ADA-compatible um, or compliant theater, um, before the ADA has even been drafted. So, hey, we're hipsters like that. We were doing, um... Handicapped accessible Broadway musicals before they were cool. Diana, I would like to introduce you to a friend of mine named um, Marvin the Paranoid Android. Or is Marvin the Android? I'm certain you two would get along swimmingly. I have these pain in the diodes on the right side of my body that's been going on for the past few weeks. I'm sorry, did I say weeks? I meant decades. Get Diana, Marvin, and Eeyore together. Okay. Ah, those are probably the right words for the moment. Okay. Mr. Sunnyside is such a wee. All right. So a couple of the so we need to build up rapport with Diana so that she's because we need to boost that in order to make sure she doesn't die. And also there's a couple opportunities here to build up some rapport with um with Jiminy as well. Most start with Central Park. We'll go with quieter occasions first. Right. That's true. I mean, in, by all accounts, it is a nice, peaceful, quiet, relaxing place to hang out in New York. Um... Okay. All right. All right. I like the concept of this of of quick time events to not to, to, to handle the pain of getting your your cut treated with hydrogen peroxide and stuff. All right.
Okay. Alright, another possible quiet and relaxing place I know about. Um, since we have, since there's a pause for a second because the timer's ticking. Um, Okay, so Bay Area. Okay, Bay Area. There's um, also Battery Park over there. I need to take a picture for um, one of the. Rosita is a nasty person, and I've already built up my report with you a bunch, so. All right. There we go. Tense build report with Gemini. Huh. Ah, but dig. You may mention in finances and stuff, but Gemini is here. So we're going to hang out with Gemini. All right. Both the first two kind of work for dialogue stuff, but the like. Okay. And it does it like. This also shows a side of Jimmy's personality as well, and I get to say something really. I get to say something, um, really nice to Jimmy. <laughs> so kind of need to alternate noisy places, quiet places. A so battery park next. There we go. Okay. All right.
Okay, is places that are full of food. Okay. All right, so we got that one. Um, so someplace a little more lively. In the village. Terry's not, not so. Jimmy's not the not at the cafe yet. Um. Okay, uh... Let's do, um, all right, uh, let's, let's do, um, The town. Yep. And Ratchet is at the hotel. Okay. Oh, of course. All right. Okay. Um. I think. No, we're not there yet. Um, actually my apartment. I want to do uh Harlem no Karen yet
<laughs> Oof. Oh, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> oh, God, really? Okay. A quiet spot. All right, so now we're double back back to my apartment, which is quiet. Not midtown, I wanted to do uh wrong one. No 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 noops. Wrong one, that was a minus. Oops. All right. Turn on. Yes. All right. Village, my apartment. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.